So um, let's do a similar one to the last one, but it'll be, I guess, one more step. Um, it says, calculate the polarity of the solution, and it gives you some numbers. It says 8.73 grams of calcium chloride. So it gives you the mass. So what's, what's the formula of calcium chloride, guys? What is it? CaCl2. CaCl2. CaCl2, right. And it says that it's 8.73 grams. And then it gives you the volume of the solution. Okay. And it's asking you, well, what's the molarity? So remember, what's the formula for molarity? Molarity equals the number of moles of the solute divided by um, the volume in liters of the solution. So, well, we don't have these either in those units, right? This is in grams, and this one's in liters, so we need to convert those. Um, how do we convert from grams to moles? Divide by molecular weight. Or the molar mass, right? Yeah. So what's the molar mass of calcium chloride? Has anybody calculated it yet? So it's going to be 40 point what was it, sorry? 110.98. 110.98 grams per one mole. Okay. And when we do that, 8.73 divided by... So now we've got the moles of solute over the volume and the volume in liters, so we can just plug and check. And when I calculate it out, I get 0 0.629 molar calcium chloride. Any questions on that one? Again, pretty straightforward. I think that uh, in this case, you just need to remember to use the molar mass as your conversion factor. And I guess remember the formula for calcium chloride. Okay.